Animal Husbandry and Veterinary Minister A.L. Heck reviewed the progress of various schemes and the functioning of government farms in West Garo Hills District. During his visit, he engaged in productive discussions with senior officers, district veterinary officers, and farm managers, emphasizing the importance of coordination to bolster the livestock sector and generate employment opportunities. The minister also announced the sanctioning of schemes aimed at revitalizing government farms to boost piglet, poultry, and dairy production. As part of his tour, he also visited the central dairy plant in Ganol, where he inaugurated a milk parlor. In addition to this, the minister also inaugurated a worker amenities building. Continuing his assessment, he visited poultry and cattle farms in Rongkon, where he assessed the existing infrastructure and discussed necessary improvements to meet production targets. Why we need to have the review meeting? Of course, I'm a little late to meet all of you to have this review meeting, but uh, uh, but good, this today we have met all of you together. Better late than never. Uh, today, we have heard about uh, many things about the farms that we are having in Garo Hills and also in the whole state of Meghalaya. We have five piggeries farms, we have uh, five poultry farms, two cattle farms, one buffalo farm, one goat farm, etc. And, et and many dispensaries, which is some are functioning, some are not functioning. We understand also the ground reality, the truth, because of the many of infrastructure at the same time also, the main is the manpower. We don't have manpower to look after this. But I used to tell this to all my review meeting. The government setting up the firms is not to do business. The business has to go to the private entrepreneur. We have to encourage our rural farmers, our rural entrepreneur, to take up the farming in the rural areas and wherever we can reach out. Today we have seen not only in the veterinary department, we talk about any department in the state of Meghalaya or any part of the country, the government has failed in many spheres to do business. And a business to do by the businessman people only, but not by us. We need only to motivate them. We need only to facilitate them. We need only to encourage them and give them the facilities wherever we are having to grow our farmers. Today we have seen so many people are migrations. They, migrate, they migrated. They take a lot of migration from rural to the urban area because why? Because of unemployment. We had to create employment and revenue to the people in the rural areas. We have to reach out to them. Until and unless we are reaching out to them, how will grow? Our responsibility, being as a minister, the secretary, director, and all we are, we have been taking our responsibility to serve the state and particularly to serve the people. When we are talking about serving, we are governed, we are governing. When we are talking about govern, governing and serving to serve the people, we should reach out to them. We ensure that the last mile activities, when they don't have anything to do in the family, they don't have to do in the individual, we have to pick them up. Encourage them, bring them to the real, to the, uh, real uh, life, to the map, then they also can grow together. That is, is our responsibility, being as a minister, elected representative. We are being the office, uh, sorry, the uh, official assignment which are given to us in the different capacity, as secretary, director, joint director, director, in different, different levels. We have so many veterinary field assistants. We have to have to take collective responsibility. Until unless we take a collective responsibility, we cannot say this. Oh, no, no, that work is belong to that district, we will not interfere there, we will not go and to help them. Oh, that is belong to part, uh, so and so uh, subdivisional area, we will not going to the, uh, disturb them, not going to be interfere them. No, that is not the way that we are working. If we are not working as family, as one family, as animal husbandry, veterinary department, as one family, our one collective responsibility, we will not be able to grow our people. 
our main intention is. What? What is our main intention is? To ensure that we reach out to the people and see that the people in the rural, in the remotest rural area, they are also promoting in their activities. How we are promoting? This is our duty. We have a sign, all of you, my friends. We, all of us, we have a sign to our responsibility today. There are those who are sitting in the rural areas, in different urban areas, anywhere. They are our family only. They are my family. It's your family. We need to grow them. How to grow them is our responsibility. The responsibility start when I'm telling you, we, all of us, we start from the self-awareness. How we create the self-awareness? That did myself as a minister, Mr. Ailhek, you have your responsibility, your awareness, to do something for the people. Self-awareness is very important to create awareness to others. How to give awareness to others? How to felicitate others? How to motivate others? It is our duty and responsibility. Until or unless we don't take our own great self-awareness, we cannot aware the other people. The self-awareness is very important. 